What is up, YouTube? It's a girl, Brianna. Back again with another banger for you. Mama, party girl, she just wanna fuck. I'm going to be telling you guys some hygiene tips they, that all females should really know. So before we even get into this video, you guys, before we even get to the video, you guys, hit that subscribe button because we're on the road to 500 subscribers. So we, our family is getting real big and that is a good thing because we need our family to get bigger and bigger and bigger so we can spread more love. And yeah, what else I was going to say? Oh yeah, you guys, I still have these crusty, dusty nails on, but this one already came off. So I'm actually happy this one came off because I'm going to take all of them off, but like, like, I don't want to, like, damage my nail by clipping them off. So, I'm going to just wait till they actually fall out. Like, this one yesterday fell out. It fell out. So, I'm like, okay, good. Well, I'm just saying, you guys, tell me something I should do for this background. Because, honestly, I think I, think I might start doing YouTube videos like this. Only because, like, it's a better lighting. Like, I'm, 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 you guys see the window right there, right? Yeah, I'm basically standing in front of my window and it's better lighting. So, you guys need to tell me what you guys should want me to do with my wall and thing. Like, what should I do with my door? Like said it's better background shall we so yeah so i'm gonna be telling you guys some hygiene tips that we all should know all all, all, all females should know so the first i'm gonna say is wipe always wipe front to back like so if like you're wiping like front to back wipe from like this to like back don't wipe from back to front because then you're gonna get some infections and nobody want no infections so another hack that i have or tip that i have is to always 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 let your towel dry before folding it up like me um when my when i'm done taking a shower i put my towel like on my bed right like i put it on my bed like this and it dry damn y'all can see my pants i'm wearing my pajamas okay don't don't come for me but um when i'm gonna take a shower i put it on my bed like this and i let it dry and then i end up folding it up so you can do that or you can keep it in your bathroom railing like i don't know if you guys bathroom have that little railing thing that you hang towels on i personally don't like keeping my towel on that just because like i just feel like when people like like if people don't have paper towel in the bathroom they're just gonna sit there and wipe their face their hands on, on your towel because that's nasty but me personally i just keep in my bag i keep in my room let it dry and i fold it up okay the next one i have is to avoid getting soap inside your vagina because some females they like they when they wash their vagina they tend to like get the soap inside the vagina i don't know i don't know by accident or on purpose i don't know but the, the vagina clean itself it cleans itself so getting soap inside of there is not really gonna help but i'm not saying tonight like, not clean your vagina like of course clean the uh, outside of it and clean you know the lips or whatever but don't don't get no soap inside the hole because that's just we're not supposed to go there so another one is i'll have is change your pad every four hours like me personally i change my pad like at least every four hours it depends like i feel like if like my first three days of me having my cycle i'm like really heavy so i'll try to change it like every three hours but if i'm not like that heavy i'll change it, like every four hours but if you have tampons i personally don't wear tampons i just feel like it's uncomfortable i don't know but um if you have tampon, change it every hour because tampon, you basically, there's blood in it and it's, it's stuck inside your little, your hole, okay? And it's like, the blood's supposed to come out and not be strapped in. So, I mean, if you have tampons, change it every hour at least because, sis, I don't want none of, none of my subscribers getting any, any yeast infection or anything. But for the pads, y'all change it every, every, every four hours at least, like, at least like every, at most change it every four hours because like quick story time when i was in eighth grade i had pe and i guess this female i don't know who it was but we was in the locker room and she was taking off her pants to change sis like everybody in the locker room was like what's that smell and i'm pretty sure us females know what that smell is the smell of like the smell of like uh a pad that has not been changed for like the longest the lo like a, the, a pad that has not been changed for like the whole day maybe and we had PE last last period last period so it just like you know that's kind of embarrassing to you take off your pants and the, the whole scent is just coming out and everybody's gonna be like what's that smell what's that smell sis change your pad every four hours please 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 because it's gonna do you justice and the people around you justice because you don't want to be in the bathroom taking off your pants trying to about to change your pad and there's a scent that come out so 
change every four hours and make sure when you go around to school i already showed you guys last year but i'm gonna do an updated one um of what i have in my little baggy bags i'm gonna add more stuff inside of it obviously but always carry on always carry on wipes with you especially when you're on your period because when you're on your period you don't want to use no public tissues to be wiping yourself you want to use your own tissues or at least wipes so it, it's kind of like the wipes will kind of like help you clean yourself kind of so yeah that's something else i should say about the pads and stuff okay something else i can say is pay attention to your discharge many of us females have discharge when i first had my discharge i was kind of confused what it was i told my mom i told my mom about it and she told me what it was she was basically like she was like discharge is normal blah, blah blah so discharge is supposed to like it's like this thing it's like it's like this thing like i don't know how to explain it but it's supposed to be clear like it's supposed to be clear and it's normal so if you have discharge don't go freaking out saying what is this what is this what is this it's normal but if your discharge is is a diff, it, uh, if your discharge is a different color than what it's supposed to be then you should go to your doctor and figure out what like what it is like if it's yellow or like i don't know what the other colors are but if it's yellow red or something like that i don't know go to your doctor and even if you have a scent like a strong scent to it you need to go to your doctor and try to figure out like what you have because discharge is normal it's supposed to be clear other than that i don't know about the rest okay so these are, these are for the people who have intercourse i don't have intercourse obviously but if you do have intercourse with your partner or whatever make sure you take a shower every time you do it like every time like after you do it please take a shower because like to have like you're still gonna have like stuff on you and especially you're gonna have stuff in your vagina area and you don't want that stuff to be there for longer than it should be so once you're done having intercourse hit the shower and take a shower take a nice clean shower and take all the extra stuff off you you know what i'm saying um another one okay wait okay another one i can say is like avoid wearing tight clothes because honestly to me like i don't really wear tight clothes like that unless i'm going out but there's some females who like constantly wear leggings, constantly wear tight jeans, like avoid, avoid wearing them because especially if you're not going nowhere, like since if you don't go nowhere, like better, you better be wearing something comfy, comfortable, something that's like, that's going to be able to let your vagina breathe because me personally, I don't like, if I'm not going somewhere, I'm not going to wear nothing tight because I personally don't like wearing nothing tight I feel like I just can't move, move right, I don't know. But if you're not going somewhere, you, like there's no reason for you to be wearing jeans and stuff, sis wear some joggers or wear some shorts or something just not if we're wearing tight clothes because you do need to let your vagina breathe like the same way you wear a jacket and you get hot the same way your vagina can get hot okay because we wear these tight clothes and it can cause your vagina to get like i don't know sweat more so let your vagina breathe breathe please please y'all females let your vagina breathe another one i can say is to always wear cotton underwear so i'm a, i think I, I have a pair of underwear that I, I haven't worn yet so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys i haven't worn it yet i think i took off all the tags though yeah this underwear i haven't worn it yet i got it last year for my birthday but i haven't worn it yet okay y'all see it haven't been worn okay but yeah this like this underwear is obviously cotton like you can tell and Y'all can see it, right? It's obviously cotton. So always wear cotton underwears because cotton underwears are better. And they let your vagina breathe more because if you're wearing synthetic, it's going to kind of hold up all the heat and stuff, all the stuff that's supposed to be coming out. It's going to hold it up. And But these underwears is doing is doing you justice. If you don't have money to go to like Victoria's Secret or Pink or anything like that, you can always go to Walmart. Like y'all probably go to y'all, y'all, y'all starting on Walmart because me personally, Walmart is not a big deal for me. Like, sis, just pick up some nice white underwear from that Walmart. They're cotton. They're very much cotton. And just wear it if you don't have money to wear these type of brands. Like, me personally, when I first started wearing underwear, I did not wear no Victoria's Secret. None of that. It's Walmart, it was. Like, make sure, at least make sure you wash your underwear before you put them on. I'll constantly, please. So, yeah. Another one I can say is wash every day please 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 some of y'all females that y'all can go home go home come what go home go to school come home and go straight to sleep just like that please 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 especially if you're you're the person if you're a person who's very 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 active please make sure you wash your vagina like wash your body because our body is very important important to us 
well to some females but like for me my body is very important to me like i'm not gonna disrespect my body any type of way and you just make sure you clean it make sure you take you keep your body intact 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 please and thank you y'all when you go when you go to home when you go to school take a shower like take a shower before you go to school even though the shower it doesn't have to be big like if you don't even if you don't feel like taking a shower you better you better hop in there and wash your JJ and then come out. If you don't feel like taking a shower your whole body, at least wash your JJ and then come out. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, some females, they were, like, especially if you're active. If you're active, please, 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 wash your vagina before you go to school and be after you go to school because it's going to do you justice. It's going to do you justice for real. I think I said all of it, to be honest. I think I said all of it. Did I? I think I said all the, the tips or the, yeah, the tips. Some, yeah, I think I said all of it. But you guys, please take care of your body because our body is very important to us. You know, your body is immune to everything. I feel like your body is like the way people look at. Mm, not really, but you know, the your body is everything to people. But your body should be everything to you. Your body should be your most important thing in life. Your body, your body, your body, your body. Because sis, you need to take care of it. Make sure it's all clean. And y'all know, did y'all know, it really is not true that if you eat pineapples, it will make down there taste or smell good. It's not true. You know that, right? It's not true. But some of y'all feel believe in that. But go ahead and eat your pineapples. Um, something else that I found out is that you should drink cranberry juice. I personally don't have cranberry juice. Neither do my mom buys it. So I'm just like, ooh, I'm ashy. But they said that you should drink cranberry juice. But if you do have cranberry juice, like, take advantage of it. I don't know. Drink it. Drink it. Drink it. Drink it. I hear it's healthy for you. I don't have cranberry juice. But I guess I'm going to start telling my mom to buy it for me, I guess. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, like always. If you guys want another video like this, please let me know. And y'all probably surprised that I'm posting a video today because normally I'll post a video once a week. But, you guys, I'm back on my grind. I'm going to start posting many, 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 many videos for you guys. Like, I'm going to start posting three to four videos. Not three. Four to five videos um, a week. So, because I want to give you guys enough content because I realize I've, I've been slacking even though I've been saying I'm not slacking. But I've been slacking and I have not been posting a lot of videos. So, I apologize for that. But please, if you're new to my channel, what's up my name is brianna so hit that subscribe button because our gang is hit that subscribe button because our gang is lit like that and that's on period so you guys please let me know what i should do with this background you see this background is boring it's boring it's boring i'm gonna paint it i'm gonna do whatever i want to do you guys need to let me know let me know what i should do so i was gonna make sure like comment subscribe like oh yeah i love you guys so 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 much remember to be yourself because no one else around the is going to be you for you and i'm out mama party girl she just want to